And Eddie going to full forward, he says, on the man. <laughs> and he is the man. Here's Davey. Modest number of possessions off to Melksham and Prismal. Melksham again. Back to the former cat, Prismal. Melksham. Bombers just can't get through. And the ricochet is with Robinson. And where's Eddie? Saturday night football, it's a big one, round 18, Essendon versus Carlton, so much at stake. Stakes are high, and we're ready to go on a very chilly Saturday night at the MCG. Almost just can't get through, and the ricochet is with Robinson, and where's Eddie? Walker's got the sit here. Yeah, I've been asked about it a lot of times, and it, it's it's one of those uh, it's one of those ones where it's sorry I can't actually remember it. The, the moment itself is it's a little bit sketchy. Then again, when you watch it over, you can sort of remember doing everything. But uh, just I can still remember Mitchy Robinson getting the ball. Yeah, you know, he's a he's a nice long kick, so I think he would have kicked it probably 60 metres that day. Uh, I still remember Carlisle just got to the right spot and. I uh, just happened to get there, get there at the same time, get that nice little ride. And the ricochet is with Robinson. And where's Eddie? Walker's got the sit here. It's a memory that I'll cherish for the rest of my life. I don't know if everyone knows, but every mark Walks takes, I seem to kick in the ball. Yeah, I couldn't believe it. I was, you know, I did a long, long bomb into the forward line and just got up on his shoulders. I just remember it was the first year I played defence and uh, our backline coach at the time, Sean Mullman, said to... Uh, Stand in front of my opponents that are smaller than me. So um, obviously Andrew Walker's a bit smaller than me, so I stood in front of him. Ball was kicked in long and I just wanted to come back and, and take the mark myself. Instead he sat off me and, uh, and then sat on me. Then I was probably about 50 metres away. I was probably near the kick that actually went to him. And, and then yeah, he saw Jake, sort of thought he had the ball and didn't know what was behind him. And Andrew Walker just sat up on his shoulders. And, the whole Southern Sand just went crazy. Everyone's up with that one. It was only about 10 metres from it. Yeah, I just remember Jake Cowell's 200 centimetres. I just remember <laughs> Andrew launching. And as he took the mark, I was just like, that's unbelievable. Unbelievable. It's just that has to be the best for the year, doesn't it, Tim? You can usually tell by the crowd's reaction what sort of mark it is. And uh, just so happened to be that I was having a shot for goal after it and directly from behind where I was, uh, where I was having a shot was the big screen and uh, had a little, little peep at it. Uh, we were 40 or 50 points up at that stage so tried to have a little look at it. The crowd is stunned. I reckon Essendon supporters are cheering this. Oh, that's the best for you by a mile. No, I was actually in the backup because I was playing back at the time and um, I looked over to my mate, Lockie Henderson, at the time and um, yeah, sort of looked at him and, and said, Wales well, is, and you know, we both just shook our head in, in, in disbelief. And all I remember is just standing there with just uh, hands in the air, just screaming, because it was just the greatest mark I've ever seen, still to this day, I reckon. That's the best for you by a mile. That was very, very high into the black sky. Yeah, I was about uh, 25 metres away from him, just in front of him. And I think, I can't remember who I was standing next to as a Nesson opponent. And uh, I just remember having a bit of a laugh. And told Nesson and Bonesson, that's probably one of the best grabs I reckon I'll ever see. I think I was just jumping up in the air, hands up in the air, because it, uh, it was so high. Um, I think if you look at the footage from this side of it, you can see walks and see me just jumping up. Um, yeah, in the air. I didn't know what to believe when it happened. It was a bit shocked, but I looked at the replay and um, actually had a little giggle. Um, and then I said to him, you know, give me some stuff if you win anything at the end of the year and he just started laughing, so probably wasn't my greatest moment, but um, no, it's it good to see. I think even the reaction of uh, Rats, Rats' face on the bench, you know, shows it all. Yeah, it was a, obviously a great moment for him, um, but it wasn't a good moment for us because we were getting smashed and, and then one of your teammates gets a hanger taken on him. It's got to be the best of the year, doesn't it, Rob? Carlisle's not a small bloke, I think he's 6'3", 6'4", and to get on top of his shoulders and have plenty of time up there to, 
you know, see what's going up in the sky and did very well. I think Jake Carlisle said he was pretty happy he was taking on him because at least he didn't remember for something, so I reckon that just summed it up perfectly. Poor old Jakey, I think, made it, uh, made his jump, extenuated his jump by sort of um, hoisting up and, and allowing his shoulders to get uh, trodden on. Uh, at first it was a bit embarrassing, but the more you see it and the more it was on TV and, and stuff, it, um, it sort of sinks in and you just laugh about it. Um, I think it's going on two and a bit years ago now, so I guess all you can do is laugh, not much you can do. Yeah, wrong place, wrong time. Walker's got the sit here. Jakey Carlisle's going to be on footy cards for the rest of his life, earning some royalties. Ah, uh, yeah, heard he come in the rooms afterwards and just said, oh, mate, um, you know, you're going to be on a poster for the rest of your life. So. The feeling was, was fantastic knowing, you know, Carlton, Essendon, the rivalry, both teams hate each other. And here, here's Andy Walker sitting on top of this guy's head, um, Jake Carlisle's head for him. And finishing it off with the goal too was, was pretty good. Glorious kick! Four strike! Yeah, it's certainly a, a market I think I'll be recognised for after my career's done. But where's Andy? Walker's got the sit here! He'll just be wishing he didn't have all that tape around his head. Oh. Yeah, good point. <laughs> <laughs>